Hey guys, welcome back to a new M Weekly. I'm starting today on a Friday just because I'm heading out for some lunch today with my American friend. I love her. Um, she's such good, happy vibes. I'm gonna go see her and actually another girl is coming with us. Another American, so I'm the only Brit. I just love being around Americans because I think they are so positive and energetic. So I'm very excited to just go have a nice little afternoon brunch with them in this really cute autumnal restaurant in London that I've been to for events before with brands but I've never just been kind of independently. So I'm excited to just go and sit, probably get a matcha and just, yeah, have some nice food. I mean, the weather's okay for now, kind of autumnal. I'm gonna put some knee-high boots on and a coat on, and I'm gonna get the tube over there. Let's go. Finish for you. Thank you. I know, and I get bread, so thank God. Thank you. Hello guys, I'm back, feeling all the positive vibes, got myself on the tubes, got there sorted, woohoo! So I've just been doing some work, just been editing a video actually, I've just put a Grease vlog live, got these slippers on which I stole from um, Soho House, Danielle was like, take them, they're in your room, um, apparently you can take slippers, I don't know, um, they're so comfy. I'm not going to get in gym kit, I'm going to head over to do a little blaze class, and then I'm going to head straight over to Victoria and I'm going to have dinner with some friends and Matt at... Um, Timmy Green. I have like a press discount there so we're gonna go there for a nice little dins because um, I haven't seen my friend Gabs for ages and Matt also has had a long week and we just want to have some nice food. So I wish I had more than soup for my lunch. Soup was a great idea and it's super healthy with a side of bread obviously and a side of spinach but I'm still very hungry. I just had so many crackers. So yes I had chest pains this morning so I didn't go to the gym so I'm paying for it and I'm going tonight instead. Let's go work out. This is amazing. Oh yeah, they went for the meat board. I went for the butternut squash curry. I went for the vegan option. You went for the meat feast option. <laughs> Look at those sausages. Sausages. Oh yes. Amazing, thank you so much. Mars bar cheesecake. got rained on after dinner but Matt gave me his hat to protect my hair. <sighs> dinner was so good. How good was the Mars bar bomb? Oh, no. We had a Mars bar bomb at the end that we like smashed into and it was so good to see my friends. So now we're gonna chill and relax and kick back. But I just wanted to show you my hair but yeah dinner was so good. And the blaze class was so hard if I did. Oh happy Sunday. So we have just been on a run. Our first official run together I think Matt. It only took four years. I am really like a keen runner, but like I've always liked it growing up, but I hate running by myself. So finally, Matt has come in a run with me and we start to our Sunday morning that way. Now I've just got a hair mask on by Pureology, which was gifted to me at a Christmas event last week. And then this, that does not look pretty on my face, but hopefully, oh, let me show you. It's gonna work wonders. I wish you guys could smell through the screen. This was gifted to me the other day for Halloween. Pumpkin enzyme mask. Um, three in one intensive skin resurface and mask exfoliates with pumpkin enzyme and peels with alpha hydroxy acid, then polishes. It's meant to make my skin look younger and radiant. So let's see. Matt was saying he wants an exfoliator, so I'm going to make him try this as well. Excited. <laughs> so I didn't vlog yesterday because it was Saturday and it was like my nap day and I watched the film Paddington Bear which was amazing. Now I'm going to get myself ready, have a little pamper and then we are heading over to, actually back over to like the Dalloway Terrace area because we're going to the Kimpton Fitzroy. They've kindly let me use their hotel room today um, and loaned me it for free so that I can shoot some content which is amazing because I stayed there a while ago for an event and I loved it and they've been so nice and said I can use it. So I'll give you a little sweet tour. Then we're going to go for a walk around Regent's Park I think and then obviously have some food right let me go wash this off but I'm feeling great after my run so maybe it's a good way to mix up our blaze sessions which we obviously love but it's kind of effort to them <laughs> so sometimes it's nice to just get out and go for a run and get that fresh London air <laughs> Matt's just telling me off using his Joe Malone perfume right we are heading out 
wearing what I've been wearing pretty much all week, but with this gorgeous little cardi on as well. Let's head, do some pics, and then we are gonna have lunch. I like a new woman now, because I actually curled my hair, and washed my hair, and put some makeup on. I've not had makeup on for two days. It's been fantastic, but I realize how much of a rodent I look without it. <laughs> I hate lifts. So I made Matt get a 187 steps up the tube. Run that we did. My cars are killing me. Made it. No rest for the wicked. Just doing a little photo shoot on a Sunday. This is a gorgeous room that I've been loaned for a quick hour to shoot in. It's in the Kimpton Fitzroy, and it's just so beautiful. So let me quickly show you it. This room in here, which is gorgeous, and then through here have like a living area. I wish I could get out onto here because this is just divine. And then through here, also like, I just wish I could get out onto here. <laughs> you have a whole dressing room, gorgeous little fireplace, sitting area, bedroom, and then the main bit, this insane bath. Look at that. So the Kimpton Fitzroy is such a gorgeous hotel. Thank you to them for letting me loan the room for a quick little shoot. Now we are starving, so we're gonna head to Franco Manca and get some pizza. I look ridiculously pale and it's very windy. We were gonna go for something healthy, but Matt said we'll go Franco Manca because it's literally next door to the hotel. Sorry that this is so shaky. I have a lot of bags that I'm carrying. So we've got some garlic bread and some eggplant parmigiana to start. We found Regent's Park. So beautiful. I know. They say no dogs allowed though, even on leads. That's a bit mean. So we went for a walk around Regent's Park, which is so beautiful in autumn. Now we're watching Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. Comment below, are you a Harry Potter fan? And Matt is just making loads of food. Being a Greek god that he is, look at that. And I, I was gonna make some healthy oat bites, but my bananas aren't actually um, ripe enough. So instead I'm gonna try and make a nice little healthy apple crumble. We had so much pizza, we're not that hungry for dinner, so I'm just gonna make snacky food. I wish you could smell through the screen. A tiny bit of maple syrup on my apples with lots of cinnamon and ginger. Just making them nice and soft before I put them in my oats. Just put some oats, some egg, lots of cinnamon, ginger, honey, and some flour, some almond milk. Let's see how this tastes. It is Tuesday. I am just in my gym kit with some comfy things over the top. Um, I'm wearing this new sweatshirt, which you can barely see, but it was gifted to me by Sweaty Betty. I mentioned it the other day, it's insane. And I am now just heading to a place in South Kensington called Pilates Squared. They kindly invited myself and Emily to do a two to one, yeah, one to two. <laughs> like personal session with a Pilates instructor on Reformer and I'm so excited. So I'm gonna set off now and then yeah, we're gonna do that session. And then I think we're gonna have a nice little cup of tea afterwards and a little catch up and then I have a meeting with a Cobots class. So lots of exercise today. <laughs> Slowing down, that's what you said. I'ma get it all up in my head. White t shirt. 
Oh, that was very close. <laughs> <laughs> no, why is that so close? Hello? Why is that so close? I think that's normal. Well, that's very close. Hi, guys. Hello. <laughs> Just been to the gym in my Burberry scarf. Um, Tell them, tell the vlog. She kept the scarf on the whole time. I can't believe it. <laughs> Imagine. No, it was <laughs> my so sweat. hard, but in the best way possible. Like, like obviously Em was doing a lot heavier weights and stuff than me. Like, we, we swapped benches at one time. And like, I had her weight on and Em had my weight. And she looked at me and burst out laughing. I was like, is it that easy? And she was like, <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so we went to um, a place called Pilates Squad, Squ uh, Pilates Squad in South Kensington that we've been invited to. They said, do you guys want to come and try a session? And we were like, yeah. Absolutely. So we went and it was amazing. So thanks to those guys for gifting us that little session. Yeah. It was nice, low impact, but nice burning. And I want to do more things for my mind that like make my abs hurt, but I'm not so sweaty. We feel amazing now. We feel great. Yeah. <laughs> we are. Funky Pressure now we're probably going to go get a, a cup of tea. <laughs> So I just had a little meeting with some of my clients and they actually took me to a Chloe Box class which was amazing. So second workout of the day done. Matt and I have now just gone and got lots of things from Itsu. I have a little press discount card um, but we paid for the rest. So what did we get? Let's do a little Itsu haul. We love it because it's so healthy. Teriyaki chicken rice bowl which is one of our favourites. Um, miso soup, which is my favourite because it's so good for you. This is new, I've never tried this. I Thai udon. And then we are obsessed with their rice cakes, although the yogurt ones are the nicest ones. What else did we get? Ooh! Matt's gonna watch his favourite football team play because they're just about to kick off. And then I got myself this for my breakfast veggie press. I got these for dessert because I love them. And then. We also got some avo. Well, we got way too much, but you know, who cares? Let's eat. It is Thursday, didn't vlog the last few days because it's basically just been me running around like a headless chicken going to meetings. So I'm in gym kit today. I'm heading for breakfast at the Ivy first, and then I'm heading on the tube to Shoreditch to go see my friend Danielle. She's hosting like a gifting event and a workout that she's invited me to. So I'm gonna go be a good friend and support her. Um, so yeah, I'll let you know how it goes. Let's head for breakfast first. In true me style, I'm running ridiculously late and it's probably gonna rain, so let's see. <laughs> me do a little workout with this one I'm supporting my friend who like she has her own method how do I describe it the Danielle Pisa method like it's her method it's her workout so that's what we were doing you know just casual just doing her workout we're wearing this we've been gifted by nimble active wear look at us twinning what kind of twinning half twinning half. um shock we found the bathtub we didn't find the wine though but look at this wait <laughs> um, and now we're just going into a little gifting suite because Danielle, my intelligent, smart, sassy friend, has made like a gifting suite with loads of really cool well-being and wellness brands. So I'll take you in there and there's food as well. So let's be honest, that's what we're here for. So, in the little gifting suite we have one of these which is, I mean I'm going for this colour, how nice, mint green. And then, there's lots of skincare in here, geology, vitamin C booster, they're like a plant, I think they're a plant-based brand, I always hear such good stuff about them. I've actually used some of their body products before. Oh, we are kind natured, a little micellar gel. The food, oh, feed of cocoa. Some snacks on the walk home. I've got some rice cakes. Not my favourite edamame beans. The little discount card that I have for it too. Back now, and this delivery came. Matt keeps stealing my Soho house slippers, so I bought him 
some of his own they look so comfy i might actually get my mum some for christmas so today's event was amazing it was a little gifted event but i was actually supporting my friend danielle and here are some of the things that were in the gifted goodie bag um it was just so nice oh my god i love these bottles i feel hashtag blessed basically just super 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 blessed that i got to go i mean these were a present from me so i'm gonna go pack now because i'm actually heading to leeds in the morning so yeah it's been a very very busy day a long one and amazing it's friday i am heading to the station so i'm heading to leeds today I'm going for a nice weekend with my mum so when you next see me I'll be in so soon. I've got a gifted press appointment. Time to get my hair sorted. My hairdresser is going on maternity leave. Cannot wait to see her. And basically, I've fitted myself in on her last shift. Oh, and I'm getting my nails done. I write all nails. <gasps> basically, a Leeds pamper day and food with my mama. So let's go. And look who's here, Mama Shell, just getting her colour and her cut done. <laughs> you look grey. So I tell my mum about Sassoon and now she's a customer here because they're the best. My mum and I have got fresh hair, it's very rainy outside, hence this pink nose. And now the place that we're going for dinner, it's um, a really amazing authentic Japanese place we've been going since I was a kid. And it's closed until 5 pm, so we're doing a little bit of shopping. And we just went to Best Peacock. I never shop in here, I haven't done for years. And we just went to Jumbo. £16 is insane, so Mum's buying it. So we just have a little bit of a detour before we eat, and I'm so hungry. But yeah, I can always count on my mum for shopping and good food. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's nice, isn't it? Good luck getting some of that gorgeous. Love this as well. They have very similar in H&M, actually. Now we're in Holland and Barrett, and me and my mum are just getting dessert for tonight, pre-dinner. I did not know they delicious the other, they did salted cups. So we're getting one of each, and Matt absolutely loves these balls, they're so good. I just love all of this healthy stuff, and I was telling my mum that me and Matt are literally obsessed with these. They're so good. What else are you picking up? Are oh, you just looking? <laughs> Yum. I love the packaging of this. Vigo is so yummy. It's like vegan hazelnut spread. It's so good, but so bad for you, but so good. Mm, deep fried prawns. You're gonna love it. <laughs> So I am back in Yorkshire. I'm here this week so I've got quite a lot of work to do so I'm filming it all here. Just been to a blaze class so I got my hair done yesterday at Sassoon. My colour was done by Louise and my cut was done by Tatty although it's dropped because we were in the rain last night. So it was a gifted press appointment and I've been going to them for years. I love Sassoon. It was actually my grandma that first introduced me to them. Um, and my mum is a paying customer at Sassoon as well. Like She loves it, we love it, it's the best. And she goes to my hairdressers too. So nice and bright, my hairdresser's going on maternity leave. So I had to go and get her freshen up. Yeah, before she goes, not before I. But yeah, look, my hair's in such a nice condition at the moment, I'm so happy. Um, so, I'm gonna do a little quick try on haul. What do I need to tell you as well? Um, I feel like I need to tell you something. Oh yeah, and last night we had dinner at the most lovely little family run independent Japanese restaurant in Leeds. I've been going for years, it's a hidden gem. Got the best food ever. So even though it's been raining for a solid 24 hours, I don't really care. We were gonna go to a pumpkin patch today, but we're just gonna go to Betty's, which is a really nice tea room, and have some lunch instead with my auntie because in Harrogate, because honestly, it's not really much we can do when it's raining. Um, but I'm just gonna quickly try some clothes on. There was 20% off these clothes the other day, so I bought myself them um so yeah everything on this video will be linked below as always next time you see me i'm gonna actually be in clothes uh, we've got this dress which oh my gosh i love it i got it in size small and extra small and extra small is perfect I might actually wear this today so comfortable i love jump dresses i'm such a sucker for them because you can wear them with trainers or you can wear them with boots so yeah this is this is a yes from me i hope you can see in the light 
top was reduced to £15 in the sale, so I bought it in two colours, because that's the kind of girl I am. It's so cute, it was only £15, and it's just so comfortable, and it's kind of like a, um, look at that material. <gasps> so nice, it's like a fleece. Um, and I popped it with this little skirt. Yes, my lights are on there because this room's a filming studio. <laughs> um, but yeah, this skirt is also gorgeous. Very happy with that. So then I ordered this roll neck and I ordered it in a small and extra small, but extra small is perfect. It was also in the sale. And I just think it's one of those really easy things that you can wear literally with everything. It's such a staple. A little bit see-through, but actually with a white bra, it's fine. Up, I got the jumper in the green. So I actually thought these were tops, but they're actually more like pullovers, and I literally love them. So affordable, so comfortable. I'm literally like a bear. You could put them with jeans, leggings, with a skirt. I just love that you can like dress them up or down. Also, these boots, if you watched my recent haul, they are just the comfiest, most insane boots ever. Jumper was gifted to me, and oh my gosh, I love it. How nice is this? With leggings, with jeans, like, I went for a size small because I wanted it to be a bit more long line. It's like a cool cricket jumper. I used to watch my brother play cricket all the time. It reminds me of that, but cricket, but make it fashion. <laughs> when you've got a cricket match at 11am and then you've got brunch at 12. That's me. Find a dream jumper dress, you buy it in two colours and you keep both colours. Extra small, both colours, yes please, thank you. Super comfortable, super soft. I'm happy with that, absolutely love it, oh just so warm, so now to decide what I'm going to wear today because I am running late, oh my gosh I'm running really late, I need to go, I need to get changed, but like I said everything will be linked below, now let's go eat. So I got a club sandwich because I always get it, deja vu, cream tea, two types of chips, mum's gone for aubergine. Comment below, do you put cream first or jam? My mum says she puts jam first, sorry. I put cream first because the cream acts like butter, but my mum's theory is that cream is used to top things. Look, how weird is that? It doesn't spread on the same if you put the jam on first. <laughs> no, I use it. That's a lot of cream, mum. I don't want that much cream. Wowzers. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take pictures on my phone and actively ask people on Instagram. This is just weird. <laughs> Gosh, that is stacked well high. Okay, and now, right, and then I can take a picture. Guys, comment below, how do you top your scone? Oh guys, I've got the Halloween treats in. No, it's a Halloween chocolate cake. Is it chocolate? Yeah, Halloween chocolate cake. And then witch biscuits. <laughs> oh, and we've got some owls and some frogs. I'm just getting a vanilla slice for later. Yum. I am so full. This is like deja vu because I think two weekends ago when I was in Yorkshire because Matt wanted to come and watch a football, I came to Betty's as well. But look, even though it's raining, which is kind of annoying because it doesn't look as pretty, it's so cute and all Tom at the moment. And I'm so full, it was so good. Guys, <laughs> this is Leeds Festival. My mum was just saying she used to drive me here literally. We've been doing this since I was in year eight and my mum just went, this is a VIP bit. There's nothing VIP about it. Um, and you used to, like, my mum got told off by the police for pulling in here and dropping us off. And then um, this is where you'd camp. This is literally Leeds Festival. The grass is growing back. It's growing back quickly to say that the festival was in August and it's October and it's fresh grass again. Good morning guys, it's Sunday, I'm still in Yorkshire. So I watched Big Little Lies of my mum last night. It's on Sky Atlantic, it's amazing and my mum has been telling me to watch it literally for so 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 long and we've been bulk watching it and we are obsessed. I mean my mum's already watched it but I'm she's re-watching it with me and if you guys haven't watched it it's literally the best programme 
ever. Really, 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 really love it. And it's just so nice to have a night in with my mum and just like not do work. So it's been lovely. So I've just been to a Blaze class. We've been taking some content, some autumn content, because honestly, who needs a Cotswolds? Yorkshire looks amazing right now. Um, now I've just got, I'm wearing the same dress as yesterday. So I'm hoping I can get some pictures in it today. And it's so comfortable. I'm literally shook. I'm in love. And I put this little cardi over. Oh my God, this is literally the nicest cardigan ever. Um, it was kind of gifted to me. I bought the dress and then this was gifted to me. <gasps> I'm so cosy. So I'm just going to put some little boots on and I just got changed so quickly. And now we are heading out for a Sunday lunch with my grandparents, which is basically something that I look forward to for so long. And I'm so, so, so happy. little old telephone box and then look it's got little books in for people to take if you leave some books please take them away at the same time it's a little book shop I was just saying how autumnal and cute these trees are and her granddad there so guys it is Wednesday why do I always forget what day it is so I am just heading out for a little walk at a place called Rano Park the nicest winteriest autumnist park so I'm going to quickly show you that and then it's my friend's baby child this weekend and I unfortunately can't make it um so I'm taking her out for dinner tonight so first I'm going to go and show you the most autumnal dreamiest place ever So we came here the other day and it looked beautiful, but this is even more beautiful. This is literally gorgeous. There we all were thinking that London was the only place that looked good in fall. This is Yorkshire. Looks fantastic. <laughs> Look at my mum's coat. So gorgeous. <laughs> I just got back from a lovely little walk at Randy with my mum. I spent the rest of the day filming videos. Now I've got my fave new jumper on. I've got really bad teeth ache and I've been struggling with it all day. And typically my dentist is closed today. So you might have to go to an emergency dentist. But I've promised my friend I'd take her for dinner tonight. So I'm going to head there. It's a gifted dinner, but it's so great because it means that my friends get to experience amazing things as well. So I've just put a little hamper together for her. When I found out she was pregnant, I did put her loads of stuff together. So I got her like bio oil and lots of pamper things for her. And now I put her some things together because I tweeted and I was like, what do new mums want? I mean, not that she's a new mum yet. And I am also going to see her literally the week before she's, well, the week before her due date. So I will take other stuff for her then. But for now, I've got her some stuff so that she can actually pamper herself, like hair masks and stuff. So many people on Twitter said a reusable water bottle. So I got her one of those. Um, face masks. Lots of things for the baby as well. So, oh, reusable things. I'm very excited to give her them. Now we eat. Chocolate brownie, how good is that look? Oh my god, chocolate melt, yeah. Good morning guys, excuse the messy bedroom. It's currently my filming studio for the week ahead. So I've just been to a blaze class while I've got a face mask on because I'm now gonna get ready for a day of filming lots of content. I'd love it if you comment below and let me know what kind of videos you wanna see from me over winter. It would be so, so, so cool to chat to you guys about that and I really want to start working on my Christmas gift guides. Also, it's November tomorrow, which means it's officially mince pie season. I'm actually so excited. Dinner last night with my friends was amazing. I went with two of my besties and one of them is expecting a baby on November the 22nd. So I was saying I hope that by the time my next come back, she, I kind of hope that she's had the baby so I can see it selfishly, but then I kind of hope that she hasn't so that I can then like time it so that I see her as soon as she's had the baby. But it was so nice to see her and she was so grateful for her pampering gifts and she said she can't wait to have a pamper and she didn't have a reusable water bottle. So she said that was a great present, so I'm very happy. 
and the food was fantastic. So, oh, and my toothache, it's finally gone off today. I'm so happy, slept on it. So I'm gonna go do lots of work and everything I mentioned on this video will be linked below. Come say hi if you made it this far in the comments, let me know if you made it this far. Let me know what your plans are this weekend. And yeah, I'm going for dinner with my family tonight. So I will see you guys really, really soon. Big, big, big love. Time to let this face mask settle and get lots of work done. But at least I just did a sick workout. Bye guys. Thank you as always for watching.